Hey guys, this is Poet Spice here, and I am here to do a Transformer Happy Planner video. I'm so excited because um, I've been seeing a lot of these Transformer um, planners, and I'm... I really have a problem with like book and book and book and book and book, like going between different books. It's really difficult for me to do like all different planning and you've got 16 different books and all that kind of stuff. I know some people like they have to do that. For me, it is totally, totally, uh, it doesn't work. <laughs> so when I saw this Transformer piece, I liked it just like I like the um, Traveler's Notebook idea. The only thing I like better about the Happy Planner craze is that you can take each individual piece out versus your Traveler's Notebook where you have to take like a whole sheet and when you get the fold, you know, you know what I'm talking about. Um, so if this was my sheet, when you fold it in half, you only have these two on one side and those two on the other. So you're really taking out four pages and it's not in order. So I really like the the ease of tearing in and out and putting back in in the Happy Planner. So I'm going to show you what I'm going to be using for summer and then into the school year. Um, I guess it's sort of, kind of like a one book July kind of thing too, but I'm not going to be doing the videos and stuff for that. So... One, I'm going to go back into my traveler's notebook that I showed previously. It's got some writing stuff here, and then it's got my like journal and tracking thing here. So I'm going to go back to that for July. I didn't do that in June, and I moved into a different one, and I didn't like it, so I didn't end up writing much. So that'll be like my journal and stuff. Otherwise, my other things are in here. So look at this. I had to get these metal discs because one they're bigger and two they're metal so I got that on Amazon this planner I showed you before and I got it at Hobby Lobby so I'm gonna show you what I did to make my transformer so I took the first three months of this 2019 planner so you have that here and hello, this planner belongs to, I just love this like vintage flower stuff. It was so pretty. And then it's black, so <laughs> yeah. So I left in the two year spread and I showed this in my other one. I put, I made this on my laminator and it just has like basic goals. So how do I want to feel? And this is basically based off of that, um, Woohoo book by that one chick that I can't remember now. <laughs> That's so terrible. Oh my gosh. Okay, so then I have July. So the July spread. I haven't put anything on here because I don't know exactly what I want to do with that page other than the fact that it's pretty. There's the tab. Here's my calendar. I did a coloring of a little bear. And see, I have an eclectic taste, so even though I like this vintagey look, I'm gonna put out and put on it whatever I like. So I colored this bear because I just got it in a, you know, I just got it, so I put it there. Um, Camp Nana was this month, so I put that in there. And then I just had this butterfly sticking around from Anna Griffith. All right, so then they have the monthly goals. So I put that down here and check it off. So I've already finished all my collabs and I organized my transformer planner. So I got to take that off the list. Um, I'm going to be tracking exercise and the vinegar drink, the apple cider vinegar drink, uh, my writing daily, and I want to hit a thousand words, and work planning because I need to do some of that stuff. Well, I don't need to, but I want to so I can have myself ready to go. Over here, I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to put. I did put, instead of noted, I put what I wanted to do. And I want to go on two trips with Mr. Man. <clears throat> and then um, over here, just the top priorities. Um, to be honest, I don't know how your top priorities and your habit trackers or however they want to say it's different. And so I don't really know what these would be differently. So I don't like repeating myself over and over again. Here, gratitude. So I'm just going to put things as they come up. Yesterday was the first and I was like, I'm grateful that they fixed our freaking air conditioner because it was flipping freaking 
hot. All right, then in this planner, you have these daily tasks. I really don't know how I'm gonna use those. Um, I don't know. So what I did get for July and June, but I was not very good with it for June, is um, I got these Happy Planner dailies. And what I wanted to do was set myself a schedule and say, at this time I'm going to do this, this time I'm going to do this, this time I'm going to do this. Well, I didn't do that yesterday. So what I basically did was what my priorities were for that day. And then these are the things I actually got done. And then these are some stuff, things that I wanted to remind myself to do. Okay. So today is pretty much kind of the same thing. And then I'm hoping that I can get myself planned like do this at this time does that make sense okay so then see here's the dailies and then I put the rest of these in here for July now after July I'm not going to be using those dailies because then well I'll use it probably up until I go back to work in August and then after that it's just going to be your regular planning so I have the August one so pretty your calendar these aren't filled out because I don't know what. And then that's when I'll have to figure out what to do with these pages. So if there's any suggestions that you have to do with these. And the funny thing is it only does six and they're seven days a week. So I don't know what that's about. Uh, so any suggestions it could be helpful. Okay, September, same thing. I'm just going to flip that. So then I'm like, yay. So there's my life everything planner. And then look, when I want to go to my notes... I just turn it over. <gasps> look, 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 look. Somehow I messed this up. Because, what I do? Okay, I might have to read back, go back and redo this. Because, what should be on the back is this. Right? Shouldn't that be on the back? So that when I open it. So let's just pull this out. This is my first time doing one, so you can see I didn't get it perfect. So when we pull this open, this should go like this, right? Right, right? So I actually should do, oh, I should do it like that. Hopefully this isn't boring, <laughs> but you'll have to bear with me because this is the first time I've ever done it. So when I go back and do that now, yeah, because that's what it's supposed to be like, right? The whole planner's on the outside. And so I put this notes thing here. And this isn't even, I don't even know where this came from. I just hole punched it and then put notes at the top. Now that is a Mamby sticker. So then this is my notes section. And this is the, um, ooh, what is that planner called? This, this is one of the, the, oh my gosh, you guys, I'm having a brain fart. Notebooks. And I thought that was so cute from the wrong, wrong design. So I have this note section, and this is basically where I'm going to be brain dumping. This first section, I just left one of their play, their dividers in here. Then they have this um, polka dot paper. Then I bought an st extra stack of this wrong, wrong paper with the gold trim. So I just threw that in every now and then. This section, this divider actually was from a different planner, and it says December, but I'm going to change that so it says Nano. So my Nano notes are right here, and then I'm going to redo this page so it's like nano camp nano right and then it's just pages mixed up this one is um november and i'm actually going to leave it november and put nano there because this will be my nano section for then um my nano rhyme i'll just change the dates and stuff like that uh okay so then my next planner should be this one so when i pull it up i didn't do these right <laughs> i'm so sad But now you can see what I did wrong, so you don't have to do it incorrectly. <laughs> so then, when I flip this planner, right? Because that's what it's about, the flip. Isn't it about the flip? All right. So then, when I'm done with this, but that still doesn't seem right. Maybe it is right. I don't know. All right, so when I flip this one to my next one, it has this flamingo. Now this one I bought in, 
one of those extra packs. So yeah, that's right. So it's on the front and the back. Okay, so this one is going to be my food log and exercise. And then I'm gonna put something on here like a yoga. I have some blue yoga frogs, which don't go with flamingos, but that's how I roll. Something like that. And then I have like a Buddha stamp. So I'm gonna put those on the front. I just have to finish that. So when you open it up, I go to my exercise one, the food log, so forth. I didn't do that yesterday, as you see, because I was setting this up. So then I just have all the dividers for that for several months. All right, then here we should have the next planner, which means I should take this one out. Right, and then it should go here. And see, I had this together and I thought it was, I did it the wrong way. So when I open this one, boop, there we have this one. And these were some extra covers that I bought. This is one of those that I had in my other planner. It's got some of them, my die cuts on it and so forth. I'm so mad I did this the wrong way. <laughs> this one is going to be like faith journaling or Bible reading or something. And all I did for this section is I had some of these where I had already put washi tape to cover the dates. And so that's what I'm going to do. Instead of just throwing these out. I'm going to just cover the thing and then write in the boxes. I don't know what it is, but I like writing in the boxes. Some people don't, so whatever. So I just took those extra pages and threw them in here. And as I go, I'm just going to go ahead and wash and tape all those off. And like, see, here's one. And I just threw them in at random. So this would be Bible reading, Bible verses, whatever. I bought this set and I it was with that other set of paper. And I, don't, I doubt that I would keep it as priorities. I would put something there. I don't know. And then we should have this one. Right. Did I get this one right? No, I did not. But see, that can't be right either. Because if you take... Well, we're going to leave it like that. <laughs> right? No, that won't be right. I'm so sorry. It seems like it should be right, but I guess it's not. So then, this would be this one here. This is just some extra cover, because I know I'm going to need another section. I just don't know what. So that's what this one is. My I don't know what section it's going to be yet. And then, I know what I need to do now. This cover has to come out. That should be done right. So now that I actually have a cover on the back. Yay! So now you know what not to do. Because <laughs> I did it the wrong way. So yes, yeah, so now this one's here. Blah, blah, blah. Yada, yada. This is my whatever it is. And then this will be back to the beginning. Now it's done correctly. Yay! If it's still not done right, somebody can let me know. I did talk about these pins, and so far I like them on this paper. They don't seem to go all the way through. There seem to be a little ghosting, but not too much so far. So I got these off of Amazon, and they had another set with my school planner. So there is my transformer planner fixed up, hopefully. <laughs> <laughs> thanks for watching if you've got one or if you've got a better way I know some people are talking about Franken planning and so forth you guys can let me know all right see you guys later thanks for watching and then check out my other videos bye bye